Even optimistic scientists are warning there will be no quick or comprehensive cures from the stem cell research. But the news today is a ray of hope for one North Texas man, one of only three Texans with a debilitating bone disease known as Stone Man's disease. Fox 4's Melissa Cutler reports he hopes stem cell science will save his life. Nick Mailer of Wiley lives in prison, not behind metal bars, but within his own body. I don't really know what's going to freeze up next. He's one of only 300 Americans with an extremely rare genetic disease that calcifies soft tissue like muscles, ligaments, and tendons into bone, in effect making him a stone man. It's building a, another skeleton around you, and it's imprisoning your body, you know, in bone, and there's nothing you can really do about it. His neck, shoulders, his back are all completely bone solid. Even his jaw is fused. He's learned to talk out of the side of his mouth, where he's had six teeth removed. Yeah, I'm a good ventriloquist, because my mouth did not move. <laughs> it's known as FOP for short. Its official medical term is as long and gnarled as the cruel second skeleton encasing him. My biggest fear is that he's going to choke. Earlier this month, doctors found a potential breakthrough that could lead to new treatments through stem cell research. And Nick finds new hope with President Obama's executive order expanding federal funding for that research. Nick knows his time is running out. His chest muscles have almost frozen up. It eventually prevents you from breathing. Right now he breathes from his diaphragm. But when that too turns to bone, he'll die. Maybe they could cure it. Maybe he could walk again. It would make me real happy if they could find something very soon, you know, within the next 10 years. You know, hopefully I'll be around to see it. Melissa Cutler, Fox 4 News.